Give me your top three chickens. Ooh. Chicken places. Ooh, wow. Ooh, wow. Shit. Um. doing today y'all we're getting some chicken and some waffles chicken and waffles <laughs> look at this guy's beard it's beautiful beautiful beard look how beautiful it is that is a beautiful beard beautiful beard fun chicken and waffle facts Back in the Civil War, uh, soldiers would get fried chicken in like care packages because the meat would uh, not spoil. So they would get fried chicken just as for food in the Civil War. Another fun fact is uh, waffles, they were started in the Middle Ages where it, it was in, for, in church to serve in communion. They would sell, or not sell, they would serve waffles at communion at church. Waffles actually first appeared in Pennsylvania, in the Dutch country, during the 17th century, when they, uh, the cooks made waffles topped with pulled chicken and gravy. Hmm? What's going on, Michael? What's happening? Everett, I will love you for that line. Now, in 1938, a different version of this combination of chicken and waffles was, uh, first appeared at the uh, Wells Supper Club uh, called Wells in uh, Harlem, New York, as the regulars and musicians would want like a late night dinner. But it was too early for breakfast, so they decided for this perfect combination of chicken and waffles. of chicken waffles were so popular that Herb Hudson 
actually created a uh, restaurant called Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles. And there we have it. A combination of chicken and waffles, legends. Ryan is leaving now, he got his chick. No, I'm with my boy Charles. Oh, I'm on the show? You're on the show. <laughs> what do you usually get here? What do you usually get here? I've been here, so I'm gonna get I usually get the chicken sausage and I add a waffle. What do I usually get? I usually get the, uh... What do I usually get? Man, um... Yeah, I usually get the chicken and sausage and I just add on the waffle. Would you say uh, Roscoe's is probably the best chicken? Ooh. No, I wouldn't say that. Top three. <laughs> yeah, I would say top three in LA. Yeah, hey, uh, getting ready to eat some of the delicious Roscoe's chicken and waffles. Freaking food. Freak food. I had a butter came off my head. It can be directed by food. <laughs> food film. How was it? Oh my god. It's so good. I'm still eating it. <laughs> so I'm here with my boy Chuck. Give me your top three chickens. Ooh. Chicken places. Ooh, wow. Ooh, wow. Shit. Um, let me see. Um You gotta take out the glasses. Oh man. You gotta take out the glasses. Um, honey kettle. Uh, I would say would be number one. But I think it's somebody, it's somebody else that has some really good chicken too. I can't think of the name of the place though. I would say Roscoe would be number three. But someplace else, Honey Kettle is definitely got to try Honey Kettle out. Uh, uh, I can't, I, I can't think of a number, I guess Honey Kettle would be number one and then Roscoe number two. Thank you. That's not here. What are you thinking about chicken seriously around here? No. I feel like I had some better fried chicken somewhere else though. But I can't think of where I had it at. Oh, man. Oh. Alright, my top three chicken places. I'm gonna go number three, Ralph's chicken. Ralph's chicken. Oh shit, Ralph's chicken is Ralph's good. Ralph's chicken is, is good is Maybe bomb. Yeah, Ralph's, Ralph's chicken is, is bomb. Ralph's chicken is so bomb. They got some bomb man chicken. Like eight Ralph's. piece for like eight bucks. Yeah. Ralph's chicken. Chicken. number three, Ralph's. Number two, Roscoe's, of course. Of course, Roscoe's. Um, what about Wingstop? I was about to say Wingstop for the hood. Yeah, Wingstop. Wingstop from the hood, number one. You get the fucking honey, honey pepper, like Rick Ross eat. The honey pepper chicken. You get the honey pepper chicken. <laughs> You get the honey pepper, chicken. That's how Rick Ross be talking when he's talking about something passionate about chicken. You get the honey pepper, chicken, chicken. Uh, but no, I want to say. Pepper, lemon pepper, chicken. That'd be all you say. Lemon pepper. Lemon pepper, fried hard. You gotta make sure they fry hard. Uh, I'm gonna say Roscoe's got moved up to number one. It was a pretty good meal today. What are your thoughts? I thought it was pretty good. Yeah, they fried chicken good today. Usually just like shit. And Charles would know. <laughs> I'm a chicken eater. <laughs> you hear that? You hear that, folks, right? Okay. We got hats. We got Roscoe hats, baby. We represent Roscoe for the motherfucking fullest in this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Your boy had, had to get some Ralph's chicken. Had to get some Ralph's chicken. Fire! Mmm!